You are now listening to my direct opinion, where I give my opinion, whether you like it, whether I like it. Okay, I like it because I'm giving it, but the world might not like it, but that's okay. Democracy is free speech, and that's what I'm all about. Okay, so I want to comment on the media action group here and say that, yes, it's very important for everybody to do something against the liberal government. If we don't stand up, we're going to lose our country, we're going to lose our freedom. I don't know why people don't understand this and why they're allowing the liberals and that stupid idiot Trudeau to do, take selfies and run our country with selfies. It's absolutely ridiculous. So, I'm going to read this to you just quickly. The Liberals are not talking. They are quiet about their plans for a vote on a day of remembrance and action on Islamophobia. Why? They were caught off guard with all the letters and they are scrambling to deal with the large number of questions that people are asking, such as, why are Canadians being accused by our government of systematic racism and religious discrimination from M103, when it is simply not true? When you go to the grocery store or the mall or the park or the, on the subway, do you not see people of every faith and ethnic group, racism, fear, even the PM said? Diversity is our strength. PM's an idiot, like I've said before. Is this double speak? Canadians have a reputation for being peaceful, helpful, and charitable. A great country. Now herein lies the problem. Yes, we're peaceful and helpful and charitable, but we need to stand up now. We, we've got to stop this and not be so charitable to our government and let them go on and on and on with destroying our freedoms and doing whatever the hell they want. I'm quite frankly getting sick of it. So this article is great. It's talking about everyone get into action and I will leave a link to this actual article so you can explore it a little bit more. Now they're talking about writing letters uh, but in reality they're talking about emails because it says if you go down here, just follow my little cursor here. First of all, there's a petition you can sign. Well, petitions are great, but they don't do anything, I don't think. Um, but sign it anyways, because it's just one more thing for the liberals to ignore. I mean, they get a petition, they'll just throw it in the garbage. They don't care. They're, they're doing what they want to do on their agenda. Writing letters, same thing. They're going to throw it out, and they don't really care about that. But it's still important that we harass them continuously and maybe a few of them will wake up because there's got to be one or two liberals within the party that don't want to destroy Canada and they're just following their leader. So here's the problem I have with these what they're saying here about writing the letters. Yes, it's important. Yes, you have to do it. But they're saying to email them because they're giving you all of the uh, ways of finding out how to email to each person. Um, I'm going to, like I say, I'm not going to comment on everything, but here it is. Write letters to, to rescind this motion. You can, you can do that, but where is it? Uh, they show you how to look up. Here it is. Find your MP. Click on the following link. Okay, so you do that. You find your MP. You click on it. So now you can send a letter to that one MP. But it's an email address. So emails, all they do with the emails is they just delete them. Don't get me wrong. It still needs to be done. But think about this, if you wrote an actual physical letter, you can photocopy them, it doesn't matter, whatever you want to do, even if it's a postcard. I've said this before and I'm going to say it again, it's more effective, but unfortunately people in our society are too lazy to do it anymore because emails are very easy. The electronic age is upon us. But think about this. If you send a physical letter in the mail, it doesn't cost you a dime. That's right. Anything sent to members of parliament through Canada Post can be sent free, so you don't have to have a stamp. Yes, it's going to cost you a little bit for the postcard or the letter, uh, you know, to print it off. And it's going to take a little bit of time. The, the, the longest time is to actually address uh, the, the letter so that it goes to your member of parliament. If anyone out there has a mailing list already made up with four labels, uh, by all means, let me know. My direct opinion at mail.com and, and I will start using that. So just think of this. Emails get deleted, petitions get thrown out, they really don't care. But if, and, and your letter, what I'm talking about, will also get thrown out, but it will arrive in a physical 
presence. Can you imagine Canada Post having to deliver thousands of postcards or letters to your constituent's office or the parliament, wherever you want to send it? Can you imagine them coming in with big, huge duffel bags and dumping them on their desk? That's what we need. That will really get their attention. Of course, that's up to, to everyone else. I've already sent out emails to everybody quite some time ago. I'm just uh, looking over this again, seeing if there's something else I want to talk about. But uh, I got a response of maybe two out of all of the uh, emails, maybe three, I did, four semi-responses. But they just delete them. They don't really care. Uh, I sent a few letters, but I, once again, I don't have a lot of time either. So if somebody has the labels that they can send me or give to everyone, that would be perfect. Now here you've got sample letters. Um, I've clicked on them and looked. They're pretty long, some of them. Uh, so that's up to you. I, I think just a letter saying, stop M103 or stop killing Canada or you're an asshole. I mean, okay, you can't really say that. Well, actually you could. Um, that's just my opinion, all right? I don't care about political correctness anymore. I really don't care. So think about that. Think about sending a few letters. Get a bunch of people together. And please, follow everything they say in here as well. Sorry, I'm scrolling up and down just to, to look at this. But uh, yeah, definitely. Definitely do a little bit of everything. Somehow we've got to defeat the Liberals. Now this has just been my direct opinion and it's just my opinion, but I'm sure that a lot of other people share my opinions. I'd appreciate it if you'd subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. I'm the only one that has these bell icons.